give you a tutorial today on how to retexture a texture for uh, changing the color on a material. I'm going to be using this program, GIMP, and uh, I'll sit. I'll uh, link the I'll link the web page in the description so you guys can go download it. But uh, so basically, what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be changing the the red right here to a different color, and that is in this texture, and it's right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to right click on this texture, show in Explorer. And once you have GIMP installed, you right click, open with GIMP. That's going to open it with GIMP. Now, this is the part that we need to change right here. So if you if you press, uh, by the way, just the movement keys, middle mouse is to move this. Sh uh, control middle mouse is to scroll. And... Um, I'll kind of explain as I go about what I'm going to be doing here. So I'm going to be using this tool right here, or uh, I'm going to be using this tool, the lasso, right here, and I'm going to be just going around and selecting that red part. And it doesn't have to be too accurate, but uh, you can also like get very accurate. You could scroll in and get like. You know, extremely accurate. But just for this tutorial, I'm going to keep it short and simple. Okay. And we're just going to go around. Like that. And we have a selection. And you press enter at the end to finish your selection. And you're going to right click colors and here's a whole bunch of options you can go through and kind of play with these different things like exposure you know if you wanted to make it brighter or darker you can go with uh, <coughs> saturation turn the saturation up or down uh, but I'm just gonna go to this option right here colorize so if you click colorize this is the easiest way to just change the color on something so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna change it to blue I'm going to do like that blue right there and press OK. And you just, I, I just went to rectangular tool and clicked off of it to, to get rid of the selection. So once you have that done, you can go to File, Override, and you can see the change instantaneously in Unity. Oh, let me uh, apply the texture, and there it is. And it's as simple as that. And you can do that for hair, you can do that for skin color, you can do that for for really anything. So that's that's how to retexture something very easily. Now it's gonna require a little bit of practice to do more complex retexture. And I'll just show you one thing else. Um, so I go back, press Control Z to go back to that selection. And here you can go to layer, transparency, and add alpha channel. This one already has one, but you need to add one if it doesn't. You could click delete, right? And let's just say you could get like uh, you can let's just say I could save this image like that, just just as a uh, an example. So you could put the image, you could put it behind the straw hat. So like let's just say you had a pattern or something that you wanted to go here, like an image of a pattern. You could put the pattern behind that, and uh, and then that could be the color. See? And that file override. And there it is. It's that simple. All right, thanks guys. Uh, I'll see you later.